shocker. See what Peter Obi said about Namlekano and his secret plan for Biafran's struggle. What has Peter Obi said? Uh, you see, anything Peter Obi will say right now, I will not advise anyone to make to take it serious yes i'm telling you because now peter obi is now sounding political any language that is coming out of peter obi now is a political language and not a neutral language as it's supposed to be you understand so nobody should give him a hundred percent listening ear. All right, I greet you, my dear listeners. This is morning news. Peter Obi, as an Igbo representative, is quite unfortunate. There won't be anyone to vote him because of the beer friends. This information came in as Peter Obi himself has given main reason why he needs to be voted for. He said that Namdekanu's plan is to take over Nigeria. I am not surprised because it has been the plan of the Igbos from day one. I am an Igbo man, so I know what we want. My visit to the IPOP leader in detention was on negotiation so that he will see the reason why he will shun this struggle and team up with the Igbo leaders so that together we can be able to achieve a purposeful presidency. Mazen Namdekano, proving a headstrong, turned down my request and demanded that I should be dismissed. I am not surprised because this is what he actually did to other leaders. Namdekano's plan to take over Nigeria is already out in the public glare. Biafrans must understand this and believe that what Namdekanu is planning to do is not for their favor, but rather for his own favor. He is accepting the pains because he wants to achieve and become most famous and most greatest, which I believe will never come to pass. He won't. You see? You see what I'm talking about, my dear listener, about Peter Obi? I want the Biafrans seriously and severely about this. I told them that this man called Peter Obi is not someone you must put your hope on. He is not someone you put confidence on at all. He's not. You get it? Peter Obi is looking... He's looking... F- for a way to succeed you see that so is this the kind of person that they are convincing the egos to vote for <laughs> oh my god my dear people let us use our number six do you understand let us use our number six before we lose it again. Before we lose it again. You can imagine. See the statement. That Nam Kanu is fighting to be an hero. To be a great man. Huh? See, I was telling someone some time ago that 
if Peter Obi dare succeed as the president of Nigeria, you know it that Nigeria is going to be worse than even Buhari's administration. Because Peter Obi is not the type that uh, that, uh, that 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 we really want to uh, that we really want to be open to the masses. That is the message. Um, Mbaka was trying to pass to us. It's not that he's trying to abuse him, but he's trying to make us to know the person of Peter Obi, that Peter Obi is very, very stingy. He will not release this money and allow it to flow in circulation. And if you don't allow this money to flow in circulation, how can people get hold of this money and use this money for what they want to use it for? He's speaking from experience. He's speaking from experience. But those who actually knows what um, uh, Mbaka was saying quickly stopped him. Hmm. My people, let's use our brains. Let's use our brains because this is getting out of hand. All right. All right. Let me hear you speak anyway, my dear people. Let's know what your take and your opinion on this very broadcast may be. Don't forget to leave there below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you